Trump may be joining the cast of Orange is the New Black if there's a Netflix reboot. In an interview with MSNBC, legal analyst Ellie Mistel dropped a major bombshell prediction now that SDNY is on it, they're all going down, the key thing from Michael Cohen's testimony, besides all the information he laid out, he issued basically a warning to the rest of the people in the Trump organization from the CFO Alan Weisselberg all the way down to the secretary, do you lie for Trump, you're going to get got. I hope it is not lost on people is that the Trump organization, which appears to be a massive criminal front, is so small potatoes that if Trump hadn't run for president, SDNY wouldn't care. Donald Trump will be waiting in cuffs. It's clear that Trump has the potential of being indicted by SDNY authorities as he won't be able to pardon himself, so winning the 2020 election is more than running on an agenda, it's more like running away from jail. Alec Mistel continued SDNY cares about stopping terrorism, putting SDNY on the Trump investigation is like bringing in Sherlock Holmes to figure out who framed Roger Rabbit. The previous comment is a huge deal as it explicitly suggests that for the SDNY to bring charges against a criminal entity, the severity of the charges must be high. In this case, Trump is being accused of felony campaign finance violations as he presumably ordered Michael Cohen to pay off Stormy Daniels and other women, all while Trump was running for office. Furthermore, Cohen's testimony is potentially damning as Trump worked side by side with Cohen on the hush money payments. Who knows, maybe Trump will order Ivanka to design a Gucci jumpsuit in preparation for his lengthy jail sentence.